Oh, baby. There she goes. There she goes. All right, let's dive in. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to Griddle Grub. Today we're making a pork chop breakfast. We got some nice thick pork chops. We got some hash browns, some really, really good butter that I'm gonna throw on these pork chops. Oof, dynamite. Let's check it out, get it going. So here's the pork chops we got. These are half a pound each. Some good stuff right here from the local spot. We got hash browns here and this is the, the butter. It's nice and soft right now. So I'm gonna be mixing that up and then we're gonna add a little something to it. So let's get it going, y'all. So we're gonna get going on these hash browns. First, I'm gonna go over here. I got these two burners on high and we are working on a temp of about 370, 385. So uh, I just wanna get this going. It's pretty cold over here. Just wanna get this going. Got a lot of, a lot of oil down. You know what? Let's get some butter mixed in this too. There we go. Oh, don't fall. All right, let's get to that butter going. We're gonna get the hash browns going first right here. So let's do that. Mm -mm. Keated some good hash browns, butter. Butter. All right. There we go. All right. Now I got these. I had uh, some paper towels in with the hash browns because I was trying to dry them out. So let me just scoop this thing off real quick. All right. There we go. Got a little splatter on my, my finger. All right. Here we go. Mix these up, get that oil and butter mixed in with it. You buddy. Ooh, ooh. Then I'm gonna spread them out, let them fry up real good. Throw some salt and pepper on them. <clears throat> there we go. Running low on salt here. Need to refill. Oh, now let's mix them up one more time. Mix that salt and pepper up. There we go. Right. Now <clears throat> I do have these two burners on still. They're on like a medium, medium low. Just gonna want to keep them nice and hot for the uh, pork chops that we're gonna throw over there. There we go. We're gonna let it cook now for. I'll give them a few minutes. So this is the way I like to do it. I get a lot of flack for it. I don't let them fully cook. I like to mix them up one more time before I let them really cook together. That's just the way I do it. Works out for us. So I'm just gonna let these go. And you know what, let's, uh, this butter, let's talk about this butter. <clears throat> I got everything in the description of what's in here. We got cayenne pepper, onion powder, garlic powder, uh, just a bunch of stuff and then one stick of butter. And it's nice and soft. So we're gonna be smashing all this stuff together. Yeah, ooh. And then, to top it off, we're gonna throw some honey in there. Got one tablespoon of honey going in this, and uh, yeah, so just a whole, whole bunch of good stuff together. Oof, love it. So let's get some oil over here. Turn this up a little bit. All right, gonna get some oil right here. All right. We're gonna throw some butter over there too. Just wanna open this up. Oh yeah. That oil spread around. Let's get some of this butter. You know what? Let's take this thing. 
make it a little easy for myself. All right, just spread that around. Put that back. Oh, that nice pork chop. Oh. Boom, just let it go. Do a thing. Got two of these bad boys. All right, boom. Now we're just gonna let them go. Let the hashies go. I'm gonna mix this butter up. And then, eggs. See how we're doing on these hash browns? Ooh, baby, that's what we want. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Keep it away. There we go. See? This is what I like. Mix them all up one more time. And I really don't mind if I get some extra crispy pieces because that's just more deliciousness for me. That's what I feel like. Alright, spread it out one more time. Then I'm gonna bring you guys back where we're, we're ready to flip these pork chops. Oh boy, we're getting close. All right, let's see how this bad boy's looking. Boom. All right, so now it looks like they curled up on the outside a little bit, so the center didn't get that nice char that I want, but oh well, these things are gonna be delicious. I'm gonna put some oil right over here. I'm gonna throw some of this butter. Oh, look at that, that looks so good. I'm gonna throw some of that right on top there. You want some of this, Ma? All right. Put that right on there. Now I'm gonna cover it. Give it like five minutes or so. Just let them cook up and we'll check them out. So these bad boys are just about done. I'm gonna check the temperature in a minute, but I think we're getting pretty close. Oh man, it's a nice little pool up there. Oh. Man, all this seasoning, it's like nice and thick. I mean, I think it's gonna be delicious. So I'm, what I'm gonna do is clean an area up, let these things finish cooking. My mouth's watering right now. And then uh, we're gonna throw an egg on top. Oof, oof. All right, let's give this thing a flip. They're fully cooked right now. They're at 145. Oh, see? Now we got a nice little, little char action going on over there. All right, so what I want, I want this side all right now yeah we're good right there so i'm going to use an egg ring let that thing get a little little oil on it i'm going to put it on here hopefully i'm hoping i don't think it's going to work that well because the egg ring is so much bigger but we're going to give it a shot anyways All right, so we did lose a little bit over here, but that's okay. We still got some up here with the yolk. Mm. Let's let this thing cook up. Oh, oh baby. There she goes. There she goes. All right, let's dive in. I'll tell you what, my mouth's been watering the whole time I've been cooking this. Look at this bite. This is a big, big bite. Let's get some of that seasoning on there. Mmm. That is amazing, guys. Mmm. Didn't even get no hashy on that. Man, that seasoning, great. 
so good. It did get real thick on my griddle and it was kind of burning a little bit, but man, so good. So, so good. Mm. Mm. Crunchy hash browns. Forget about it, guys. I was hoping it'd be a little spicier because of the uh, cayenne that I put in there, but it's really not, like, at all. Man, I'm about to get in and eat my dinner. I appreciate it. All you guys for coming along watching it smash that thumbs up if you like the video let me know if there's something you want me to cook and we'll see you on the next one thanks